Even though Blackpink members have renewed their contract with YG, some fans are still worried because the renewed contract only served the purpose of group activities. As for individual contracts, on December 6, YG officials stated that discussions are currently ongoing between the company and the members. On December 7, Dispatch provided information that Yang Hyun Sok benefits the most after Blackpink renewed their contract. Dispatch also revealed in the article, although YG has extended the contract with Blackpink for group activities, they are still discussing individual activities. Some members have expressed their intention to pursue their individual paths rather than with YG when it comes to personal activities. Specifically, if Blackpink signs a group contract but does not sign individual contracts with YG and moves to different companies, the four Blackpink members will only participate in group activities under YG, such as group albums, concerts, and world tour. This case has also occurred for some K-pop groups like Girl Generation, Super Junior, or most recently EXO Dio under SM. Earlier, there were many rumors about the four Blackpink members negotiating terms with different companies. Rosé was spotted having a private meeting with Ron Penny, CEO of Columbia Records, a U.S. record label. Lisa has been repeatedly emphasized by the Korean media about her early decision to pursue her own path, while Jisoo and Jenny were rumored to establish their own management company. However, Moonhwa Ilbo in South Korea previously revealed that two out of four members are considering continuing to sign personal contracts with YG, citing an industry insider who said, some places are offering tens of billions of won to recruit them. However, some members believe that collaboration with YG will be more effective because the company has a lot of experience supporting Blackpink until now, so they are still in contact with YG.